Map.fingerprint fingerprint dystrophy. Don't miss it. Map.fingerprint dot fingerprint dystrophy is an epithelial basement membrane dystrophy. And the reason I say don't miss it is because it's really easy to miss. And in my experience, once I knew about epithelial basement membrane dystrophies and how they present on examination, on cell lamp examination, you tend to see them so much more frequently and you think actually they must be quite prevalent and there are some studies which show that actually maybe about 25% of people may have some epithelial basement membrane abnormality. Now in terms of nap dot fingerprint dystrophy it's the most common anterior corneal dystrophy and it's really characterized by an abnormal attachment between the corneal epithelium and the underlying basement membrane. It's usually asymptomatic but patients may have recurrent corneal erosions and the most common time when they get these recurrent corneal erosions are when they wake up and they have these symptoms of pain, watering, redness, foreign body sensation and you know the reason it's got this name is because they have these geographic patches which we say are map-like, and they also have these dots, which are cystic-like lesions, and you also have these fingerprint-like lines. So remember, the patterns result from abnormal basement membrane attachment formation and defective epithelial adhesion. So what should you do for these patients? The answer is really topical lubricants as an initial treatment, but for patients who have frequent or severe erosions, you might want to consider bandage contact lenses, epithelial debridement, anterior show of puncture, or even phototherapeutic keratectomy. The prognosis is generally quite good, but symptoms can recur and patients should be counseled about this. One of the best treatments is prevention. There you go, you can see some, you can see some map-like geographic patches there. And you know, the best treatment is the prevention. So ha having patients use topical lubricants in the long term as a preventative strategy one of the things that i tend to recommend is um, a paraffin based eye ointment to use at night time because night time is the time when they're most likely to have those erosions because of rapid eye movement sleep um, and this tends to work quite well so i hope you have found this video useful and share in the comments how you manage your patients with um, epithelial, epithelial basement membrane dystrophy